Hello YouTube, my name is Chris J and today I'm showing you one of my favorite games and it's called Railroad Tycoon uh, 3. I remember myself playing this one uh, for quite a while. It seemed really challenging for, for me at the time. I think it, I was still in school when I played it. Anyway, recently I found this one on Steam and decided to give it a go. I think I didn't finish the, the campaign when I, uh, before, so I decided I'll go through, uh, go through it mission by mission, and just um, and to see if the game still works or or not. Uh, yes, I know that uh, on the Steam page, it says that this game doesn't work with modern uh, Windows versions, but you can uh, sort of uh, fix it yourself. You just need to find a couple of files and I'll give a link down below in the description to a different video uh, made for by a different guy, I don't know. I think it was Quill who explains it better than I will. Mm, I think it's this game is still worth uh, checking out. This I think is uh, the third uh, campaign mission uh, where I need to connect um, Sacramento to Salt Lake City. And I have already done it. Now I'm just going for the um, for the gold reward, and I need to carry ten cars of troops between Salt Lake City and San Francisco. And it's already the last year, and I doubt that I will manage it. But silver is good anyway. Mm. If I had if I had to start from the beginning, I think I'll um, I would concentrate more on creating the troops and then connecting the, the two cities as fast as possible just to be able to deliver those troops I think it's I think I started to do it uh, j just a little bit too late and I could have done it well this this map this map is quite interesting because you have to cross uh, quite high mountains but as you can see I've uh, laid out the track in a, in a in a way that is not too uh, heavy on the trains always trying to find the most level uh, way and I didn't use any tunnels as well maybe some bridges but no tunnels because they uh, cost uh, quite a lot in this game yeah and I'm still enjoying this one I had a look at uh, some modern train company simulators but uh, most of them uh, don't work as well as I would like and as soon as I found out that I can still run this game on my on my system, I didn't uh, think twice and got it on Steam and yeah, I like it still. Could be one of the best games in the genre, but it's just me. I'm still uh, nostalgic for this game because I played it quite a lot before. Yeah, looks like I won't manage to deliver uh, the cargo because I'm quickly running out of time. Uh, but yeah, I can show you the scenery maybe a little bit. Yeah, the graphics maybe have aged a little bit, but in this case I don't care about graphics. I'm used to them. And uh, it's more about the enjoyment of the game and uh, the challenge the game creates. If you're no nostalgic for this game, uh, have a look at the video that is in the description below and try to find the file that you need. I'll try to give uh, the link to the file itself because I downloaded my downloaded it uh, myself from somewhere. If you want to play this one, uh, just just use those links and have a go. And I hope uh, you enjoy this game. Thank you for watching. Yeah, give this one a like, and uh, see you in the next one. Bye.